Hello and welcome back to the third rail. It's going to be a shorter video than usual today. We are taking the Merklin 0050 set out for a quick spin. This set was issued by Merklin in 1985 to commemorate the 50th anniversary of the introduction of Merklin's first HO product in 1935. At the time HO was called 00, sorry Brits, you didn't invent it. Models in double O were initially larger than the 1 to 87 scale that was advertised. They progressively shrunk to get closer to the 1 to 87 scale after the Second World War, when production techniques became available and demand for more prototypical models increased. The set was a single production run, it was marketed through the dealer network who were given a special brochure and it had to be pre-ordered. It is a reproduction of two of the first 00 sets as they appeared in the first 00 Merklin catalogue in 1935. We have the R727 on one side and the RS for sugar 765 on the other side. It is kind of a marmite set, and I understand why. It's very difficult to get the balance right when reinterpreting classic designs, so the opinions on this set vary. The jury is still out as far as I'm concerned, but it is part of my collection theme, so I had to have one. The set was nicely presented. It's a large grey box with silver lettering and drawings of the content. It used the same color scheme as the 125th year anniversary sets released the year before. Both sets are individually packaged in their own box and each set comes with a commemorative coin. One is stamped with the 1935 Merklin logo, the other one with the 1985 Merklin logo. Both locomotive chassis are quasi-identical. They are nothing like the original and use a DC motor with a worm gear and they don't have traction tires like the original though. Here is how both sets look like. We have the steam set first, so the steam locomotive and three identical thunder boxes. And then the uh, electric set, so an electric locomotive and a few freight wagons. Both sets are completely made of metal. Now, just to check whether Merklin got the scale right, I got my oldest piece of Merklin out. It is a low-sided wagon, model number 464, from 1936. If we compare the font types used and location of inscriptions on both cars, I'd say it's pretty much spot on. So are the couplings and buffers, as well as the length. I'm going to add my little 1936 wagon to the electric set. So this completes the quick introduction. Let's switch to the track now for a couple of minutes of traffic.
So, this was set 0050. What do you think about it? Let me know in the comments. I'm curious. For now, I'd like to thank you very much for watching. This is much appreciated. I'd also like to thank you for all the subscriptions, likes and shares you have been giving me. I find these very rewarding and they keep me going. They are also a good way to increase the visibility of the channel. Many thanks again for this. Bye for now.